Hello everybody and welcome. New York Sheriff violated Hatch Act by flying pro-Trump flag at Summer Boat Parade. Uh, Oswego County Sheriff Don Hilton received a warning letter from the U.S. Office of Special Counsel. Pretty special over there. And upstate New York Sheriff Don received a warning from federal investigators for violating the Hatch Act by flying a Make America Great Again flag during a pro-Trump boat parade last summer. So this is last summer. They're just now getting around to violating him because guess who's in office now? When Trump was in office, this just was, you know, nothing. Big nothing burger, but now, huge deal, okay? Now, if you know anything about the Hatch Act, okay, the Hatch Act was a... 1939, it has jurisdiction to enforce federal law that limits federal executive branch employees from engaging in political activities on the job. So basically he was on the job and he was being political and now he's received a warning violation. Mm -hmm. Because I'm sure of uh, the new uh, president had a problem with that since it's Trump because everything's anti-Trump. No Trump. We don't do Trump no more. Anything Trump is out. Okay? As a matter of fact, I think I should change that to just entirely a big giant Trump thing. Don't you think? I'm thinking so. I'm thinking people need to know that Trump is still in the game, sons. Unfortunately for you, he's still in the game. And uh, he's got a buttload of, but of supporters. So, um, Trump is, uh, still very much so around and, uh, probably coming back. So, Democrats and government watchdogs have fumed over Trump holding RNC activities at the White House and raised various alarms from Secretary of State Mike Pompeo making a convention speech while on a diplomatic trip to Jerusalem. Okay? So... Basically, uh, this sheriff is getting a lot of heat coming down from the federal government, which is unfortunate. But, uh, you know, photos published by a local newspaper showed this sheriff and three uniformed deputies aboard a labeled sheriff marine patrol boat flying the pro-Trump flag. So, uh, I guess they got their picture in the paper and feds got a hold of it. And now they're, you know, sending this guy a warning. The OSC has jurisdiction to enforce the Hatch Act. Yeah, I didn't know what the Hatch Act was until I just read about it. I thought it had something to do with chicken eggs. So a 1939 law that limits, you know, I already read that, but, you know. Uh, Hilton has duties in connection with federally funded programs. He is covered by the Hatch Act, a letter said. Covered employees are prohibited from using their official authority to influence or interfere or affect the result of an election. So I guess this uh, really kind of swayed the election one way or another. I doubt it. Um, but they're thinking so. So anything Trump has to be stamped out immediately. And uh, hell, this was done last summer. So basically the sheriffs received a warning about not flying no damn Trump flags at no damn boat rallies or whatever the hell. And uh, the federal government came down on him, man, which is a damn shame, but you know how it is, man. Biden administration is, you know, anti-Trump everything. And uh, this is one of them. So thought I'd share that with you, and that'll be it for today. I do appreciate you watching. If you would leave a like and subscribe, I would appreciate it. Have a good day.